Dr. Sanchez here. I am a third year surgery resident and welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, today we're going to be doing a day in the life on plastic surgery and my plan was this morning to get up super early and do like I don't know like a very aesthetic morning routine but then I slept in on accident <laughs> so we did not do that. So currently I am in the Starbucks drive through uh, getting my little Starbucks drink and then we're heading over to the hospital. We do have one inpatient that I need to see and then we have two surgeries today. Okay, Invisalign's out. It was giving me a list, but uh, we have two big surgeries today. So one of them is actually a joint case with transplants. Interesting story. And then there's another one that latissimus dorsi flaps, taking tissue from the patient's back and kind of transferring it and reconstructing her breasts with it. We have secured the items so we got a little chocolate croissant and then i really wanted the beach the peach peach tea lemonade because it's freaking delicious but they didn't have it so i got the green tea lemonade that'll work okay a brief word on plastic and reconstructive surgery everybody always thinks of plastic surgery and they think of you know cosmetic surgery which is part of the plastic and reconstructive spectrum Plastic surgery is one of those specialties where I feel like you can kind of tailor it to what you want to do. You can specialize in one little tiny part of the body or you can operate on every part of the body. <laughs> a lot of what I've been doing in the past two months when I've been on plastic surgery has really been more on the reconstructive side. So a lot of it has been breast reconstruction. There is kind of head and neck reconstruction. There's all kinds of different things that get tied into it. I'd say the bulk of it has been breast reconstruction. I've gotten to see, you know, reconstructions with implants. I've gotten to see a lot of different flaps, a variety of things, honestly. Okay, now we're gonna run because I have to see this patient first and then see our patient in pre-op and then go to the case, the first case, which should be starting at 8 a.m. this morning. I got up at 6.15 this morning. I know, a freaking dream. <laughs> Not for me. <laughs> we just finished up with our first case. We went in and did the plastic surgery part and then the kidney transplant team actually implanted the kidney. This was a living donor transplant. And then we went to clinic, saw some patients and then came back and we just closed that patient. So now we're just waiting for our second patient. I'm gonna go grab some food. <laughs> It's been kind of a crazy day because we started the first case and then we ran over to clinic and saw 11 patients and then we ran back and then we closed and now we have another big case. <sighs> it's food time. I'm gonna go get some food. I'm hungry. I'm always hungry though, so. Stuff 
on my shoes. I missed the real lunch, but there's snacks. Some chips. Cereal. <laughs> Sunshine is good for you. You know what's also good for you is taking time to rest. I was just on vacation last week, so I feel super refreshed. <laughs> like, I just feel ready to get back to work and do everything. Well rested, I'm ready to go. We are walking over to the office. Something else. Uh, oh, I forgot my cup. Si you me lo I to me 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 <laughs> to Okay, so I'm just driving home. Went to the welcome reception for our new interns. We had a taco truck and margaritas, which was great. I totally forgot to film the taco truck. I got really distracted by the taco. But overall, I think we had a good time. We do have to all be up super early tomorrow. We have M&M starting at 7 a.m. Um, at the hospital that's a little further from me. So I have to get up a little before six probably to make it there on time. So I am going home now. I'm going to get some rest so that I can hopefully get up bright and early in the morning. So <laughs> thank you so much for watching. I will be posting more of these videos soon and hopefully filming a little more and not forgetting to film. 